We started with a two-week course which was called Continental Shelf and Gulf Stream Oceanography. We proceeded to embark on a two-week sail from Charleston all the way to Bermuda in which the students had the opportunity to pursue independent research projects. The whole purpose of the program was to immerse students into science and to have them conduct real research with data they collected so it was very personal to them. At lab you deployed the equipment and retrieved it. There were a bunch of different bottles in a carousel. You would deploy it over the side of the ship and lower it down into the water and watch how far it was going down and then on the way up you would stop it and trigger the bottles to go off and collect water for sampling. The students also were part of the crew of the boat so they had to help sail and operate the vessel during the whole time. Uh, this involved seamanship, putting up sails, which they were trained by SCA personnel. We had a line chase as a little bit of an incentive to learn all of the sails and all of the lines quickly. It was really neat because you got to learn how sailing has been done for centuries. Everybody learned the lines, learned the sails, learned how to sail a tall ship within a week. I mean, it was amazing. I learned on the ship that you have to work as a team, what you do affects everyone else. We were just thrilled with how much an individual student learned while being out at sea, how much they transformed into being a scientist. A lot of the students really got an experience of what it is to research at sea, and they can now make much better decisions as to if they want to do research at sea for graduate school. It was a good time to just really put a lot of things into perspective. I thought that it was a really good opportunity to see what being a career scientist, a field scientist was like. I loved it. I would definitely do this experience again.